Good morning. We're going to show a short video on my way that I print on rice paper. In front of you, this is a black and white photo of the four inch, pardon me, these are three inch tiles. So you can get six three inch tile photos on an eight by 11 sheet of paper. And in comes my other gluing template for four inch tiles. And I also have one for five inch tiles. I have these saved in pages on my MacBook. They're black and white, and I use them strictly for a gluing guide. Next, I will take a scrap piece of paper. As you see on the back side, it's just scrap. And a good white on the front side. I will lay it on top of my template. And as you look through, I'm not sure if you can see it, I'm using a two-sided tape that I bought from Joanne Fabrics. And I can see the outline of the photograph above. So this is strictly a taping guide. So I will take my tape and I will run it where the photograph is not going to be. So I, I run a couple pieces of tape, trying to make sure I don't get it underneath or above the photograph. And then I go along the bottom edge, a couple of places, missing the photograph. Okay, now that I have my paper taped up, I will remove my template off to the side. This is the sheet of paper that I will put my rice paper on top of. I take my rice paper. It is smooth on one side and rougher on the other. You put the smooth side down. I just kind of lay it on top, smooth it out. It is now adhered to my backing of my bad paper. Next, I will do is just take a straight edge and a utility knife, cut along the four sides to follow in my eight by 10 piece of paper. And then I will take this to my printer and I know in my printer which side gets printed. So in my printer, I put my piece of junk paper facing up in the tray, put it in there on my photograph and my pages where I have my original documents with the photos that I want to print, such as these. These are photographs that I already have printed on rice paper. And you can see by, I'll show you, you can see this here and there's no glue or tape underneath the photo. It's off on the edges. So when I take my straight edge and cut along these, the photo stays and comes loose of the backing, which is this piece here. So in a short, that's what it takes. Straight edge, cut this off. In my printer, upside down, like I show you here in, and it prints it off and it comes out as such. And then I trim off the photo from the backing of the trash paper. And I have my photo to decoupage on my tiles.